Hello guys, welcome to episode two of Tap Me In. Today. Sorry, sorry for the uh, late upload. We've had some <laughs> uh, we've had some problems getting some cool beers for you, but I assure you we have quite a few ones now. Uh, today we will be starting off with the Elysian Salute to the Sun. Has a pretty badass label there, very sparkly. Go a little closer. Ooh. Yeah, this is fancy. Look at that, it looks like a uh, holographic Pokemon card. Oh god. <laughs> well. Kill me I now. I apologize. <laughs> Give me cancer. We're trying to class this jam up. <laughs> Give me cancer now. <laughs> <laughs> Ravioli, holy cannoli. <laughs> All right. <laughs> There you go, guys. <laughs> that looks to be about even. It does. Better be even. Thank you for pointing, Joe. I'll not drink it. There right, you go. This is what percentage? Uh, 5.5. No, I think it's 5.2. Uh, you lie. 5.2. Oh, nice. That's the first thing I look at. All right. That's what's important. Cheers. And taste. Obviously. Let's see how this Charizard tastes. It's not cat pee. That could be the cat pee. <laughs> <laughs> that could be the cat I wonder, pee. I wonder if there's any mosaic cops in this. Any no, what? it does smell like cat pee. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> if your, cat, your cat might have a drinking problem. <laughs> That's what it smells like. I think it smells like the inside of an old man's pocket. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it just smells like cat pee. <laughs> Here, take a sip. Hold on. Oh, then I can't taste it. Yeah. <laughs> All I smell is cat pee. Now it's all I taste is cat pee. How do you know what cat pee tastes I like? I don't. It tastes like <laughs> what it smells. It tastes very weird. I don't like it. I think it's fine. It doesn't really taste like anything mm. to me. I don't love it. I don't hate it. It's like kind of sour. Kind of sour, and I like sours, but. I don't care for sours at all. I don't, Isn't it a little I sour? We got something special sour. for you at the end. It has oh, a yay. weird aftertaste. <laughs> it's going to be amazing. Oh, God. I mean, from the looks oh. of it, it looks like it would be have more of a hazy flavor. Everything's hazy. Oh. Ew, I don't like it. I smell cat pee. And it tastes like any kind of basic. No, it doesn't. It doesn't taste it like doesn't a taste Longmar like beer a or anything. Bud it, just Light. Tastes, it, it just tastes. I actually kind of dig it. Like, this is my like, first IPA. Is there like lime in it or something? Yeah, there's black lime. Oh, which is that's probably what it is. Kind of like a dried out lime. What is it? Yeah, it's a rotten lime. Ew. Here, here's a garnish from the bar. Here. <laughs> we found it. Yeah. <laughs> on the floor. <laughs> we, the fridge. we didn't want to buy a lime, so we went to like four different bars <laughs> and asked for drinks and then never, never used the limes and brought in our beer. <laughs> yeah. that's, that's kind of what it reminds and me of. Enjoy our garbage fruit. Is and lime a fruit? Garbage fruit. Is lime a fruit? Yes. I don't know these things. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yes, it's a fruit. I know my fruits, girl. That's a weird effort. I would say we should, we, should, we should have a debate in the comments, but I already know what the answer is going to be. <laughs> <laughs> that is fruit. Which is fruitier, Dave or a lime? <laughs> Dave, obviously. I, Everybody I likes. think Dave's more of like a lemon because he's kind of zesty. <laughs> <laughs> well, hello, Sambo. Mm. Mm. Uh -oh. I think this is fine. If I had never had an IPA or anything before, it's an IPA. It's the lime that I'm tasting. It's a pale ale, but it is a hopped pale ale, so. I don't like it. If this was my first introduction to a pale fancy ale. beers, <laughs> is this I would a fancy be like, beer? oh, this is fine. It's not as hoppy as I thought they might be. I don't know. It's I think I would anything. rate this a three. Maybe a 2.75. 2.75. Why don't you read that for all the people? All right. <laughs> Salute the sun. Pale ale with black limes. This pale ale is conditioned on sun-dried black lime Ooh. and vibrates with a ridiculous amount of citra hops. It's Slightly vibrating. tart. Highly citrusy. Super chill. It's I not do, my vibe. I, <laughs> <laughs> I do not taste the tart. I do not taste the citrus. I don't either. Well, it I taste the like, black lime. It tastes like something that they would charge you like $12 for if you were at some resort in like the Caribbean. Oh, yeah. You're like, oh, it's very fancy. And it's, okay. Now the next one we okay. have. Where did we get that? We got that. Well, actually, that was not where you were thinking of. Okay. We got that from the office in BSL. Oh, fantastic. Very helpful. Who was our friend, Nick? Yes, Nick. Nick? Yeah. And then Rob. He knew a lot. Rob, the owner there, he's a cool dude. 
Yeah. He's got his own little channel. I am spacing out on the name. I think it is what are we drinking now? But it I is. will have their yeah, I will have that. their name in the description. Yes. For you. Yeah, we can do that. Alright. What are we drinking now? So <laughs> this I got at the office as well. This is the from Dogfish Head is the liquid truth serum. <laughs> Ooh. I really hope I don't say all kinds of truths. <laughs> Dave doesn't need that. <laughs> but I'm really, I'm really, I'm good. but I am really excited about this one because, as, as you can tell, I'm kind of an IPA lover. Yes, and you do love Dogfish. And Dogfish Head's kind of one of the breweries that got me into really liking beer. Oh so yeah, I, you can't see the sign. But they don't. Maybe one day I'll show them the oh, sign. I see it. Oh, the sign. Oh yeah. But uh, I may be a little biased on this one, but I, I'm, I'm, I'm expecting a lot of this. What's 100 the, subscribers what's and you can see the sign. What's the alcohol content? <laughs> This what one should 10? be no, seven, seven on the dot. Oh, I appreciate that. I think one of the new subscribers is my mom. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, mom. Oh, I didn't tell my parents. I should. I so do. We ha it looks like we have more people that enjoy us. <laughs> All right. Much like in real life, half of our friends are our parents. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Well, Charles. Yes. Do the smell. Smells better than the last one, I can say that. Oh, that smells great. It looks like a frothy pee. It doesn't at least it doesn't smell like pee. True. Ooh, yeah. It smells a lot less strong than the other dogfish heads tend to. Like the 120 or whatever? Yeah. Well I, I well I think I've only had no, I don't think I've ever had a sip of that. I've tried the, I've had the ninety. Okay, I've had the ninety. Yeah, the 90 is surprisingly a lot more brute than the 120. I haven't had yeah. that in a while, so I can't compare. Hmm. I got a couple. I like this. I got a couple of my dad's fridge. Maybe one day I'll I'll take a couple of those and we'll we'll review one of those on the show. That would be amazing. <laughs> oh my god. That would be a bonus episode. That's a potent beer. We'll yeah. keep you on the what's it? Not the seat of your pants. <laughs> edge, edge of your seat. Edge of your seat. Edge of your feet. I don't know. You'll, edge of your seat. An maybe. I, ooh, look at that. An IPA bursting with. All the hops. All Obviously, because the there's little hops on the can. And then the there's can. a little thing on the Did side there. The can? Yeah, I showed the can, but there's okay. little things written on the top. They look. Man. They don't look like hops. They look like little cartoon, like great people. Myth. Um, hop bitterness can only be achieved in the boil. Truth. Four different hop additions added in the world. Whirlpool will make this beer truthfully hoppy without being deceptively bitter. Juicy and unfiltered. I'm deceptively bitter. Hmm. No. I, I, these hops yeah. have a better life than I do. Mm. I love dogfish, but I, but I kind of hate that whole can. Yeah. I, I think like it's it. cheesy. I think well, it's, the hops are cheesy. It's very hipster. I like the blue. Though. I'm all for hipsters. I've been to Raleigh once. And hey, he hey. wore a, what was <laughs> the hat? What's that called? He wore a hipster a, hat. So he's a hipster. It's not a beret. Oh God, if you were a beret. <laughs> a fedora? Maybe next video. Like Maybe next video I'll put my cool hat on for all you folks. And the red pants. His hipster hat. I can't see the pants. No. Pants. Oh, we'll show him the pants. All right. Mm. No one cares about pants. But honestly, I'm a, I'm a I real like fan this. of this one. I mean, I don't love this it. I like um the one, what were we drinking before? What was I drinking? The Sunburst. The Weekend Vibes. Yeah. I like that one better. <gasps> I like this. I would give it a 3.5 for comment. what it is. I do like that What'd it's 7, 3.25. Okay. Oh, I, that's pretty low. Eh. He's pretty critical. I, I mean, he is. You are for what it is because it doesn't. You it's not, has, doesn't have a strong flavor. I mean, I'd be able to drink many of these. Oh yeah, it doesn't taste it's yeah. easy. It doesn't taste like it's seven. No, so. and it, I don't like hoppy. I don't like real hoppy, and I don't taste. Well, I would say because I never said my I don't know the first hoppy. one. I don't the first beer, I think I'll give it a three point five. This one. First one, I'll give it two point seven five. Uh, you lowered it even, Jesus. I did because I didn't like it. <laughs> now this one, I think I'll probably give this a four. That's only because you like dogfish. I'm but go with three point five. Because the label is so lame, I would deduct no, it to 3. a three point seven five. Yeah, 3. but I would give it. A, I would give it a th uh, You know, a four. But I mean, it's and clever marketing. Like People are gonna buy it. Yeah. Oh, hey, I bought it. Can. It's not that I don't like IPAs. Let's make sure this we try it. We favorite. can't waste beer. Joe and his white pours. Because uh, you all talking about how much you hate it. I didn't say hate it. You don't hate it. it. <laughs> Nobody said hate. 
We don't hate any beer. Exactly. Maybe, but also, well, this is what, 7%? Yep. Yeah, this would be easy to drink a lot it, of. And yeah, not and not think you're drinking. Realize how much you've been drinking. Not heavy, but a strong beer. That's why I gave it a full. So that's fun. It's like the poor man's roofie. Mm. <laughs> Watch out, Bill. Perfect to go. <laughs> Watch out, Mackenzie. <laughs> I like naming locals. We know why I'm naming them. You know all the locals. You know too many locals. Yeah, I'm right. I'm Southport. You Spanish are a local. Mm. No, you're not. That's, <laughs> that's the rudest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> I'm Southport famous. I think that's the saddest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> yes, it's pretty good. I not my favorite. I it goes down, down, it goes it down easy. It does go down easy. Not my favorite, though. What did I say if these went too fast? <laughs> Especially for uh, the 375 I spent a can on this. This is pretty awesome. Oh, that was only 375? Yeah. Go that, to Okay. Go go to the office in BSL. This is a great freaking beer. What did I rate this before? I don't remember. 3.25? I'm raising it to a 35 because the price is so cheap. For a strong beer. For a stronger beer. Okay, I'll yeah. do a 3.5 as well. Just because of that. I mean, uh, this. I mean, it, it's drinking easier than. Oh. Yeah. That's way better than last one. Also, in my opinion. I mean, we didn't really Except cleanse our was... palates. We ate a bunch of pork earlier. She cooked it, a so we might all be dead no, from trichinosis. No, I can't somebody. <laughs> um, you can. There's devices. That'll uh, be a different show where we try those out. That's on but, another channel. <laughs> which was down this morning for some reason. Mm. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. I forgot what I was saying. It doesn't matter. I forgot. Yourself put All right. This. But I got one that I think Courtney and I will like for the next one, but I think Dave will absolutely find it repulsive. Oh, wow. Mm. Woo, I'm excited. Should I rinse the glasses? Mm, well, we don't, rinse we don't a little edit. bit with the beer, but regardless, you're not going to like this one. I guarantee it. We don't know how to okay. edit and we don't know how to pause. So maybe Shh, not. Don't tell them that. They can I tell. I think it's fairly obvious. There's <laughs> a little bit. So this one's strong. If it? Mr. Bo had opposable thumbs, no, he'd be able to push the rinse. pause button. Oh, okay. Where's my kitty? So just kind of drink it's that. It's filming. <laughs> <laughs> so drink, like drink that little bit there. And then you'll get the it smells like red wine. It smells like cherry. Oh, you're not going to like this at all. Imagine, what if, if you I like do, it? I'm going to be very disappointed. And Actually, you might. It smells like red wine. It's, it tastes amazing. Mmm. Mm. Oh, oh, oh there you go. <laughs> kind of tastes like soda. The sour soda. Oh, I swallowed it. Too it hard. Like oh, black that sounds bad. <laughs> it tastes like black cherry seltzer that my mom used to put on my lunch when I was a child and she thought it was fat, so she secretly put in diet cherry seltzer. Well, that's why you drink diet Dr. Pepper. Now, <laughs> that is what we got here the Duchess. And now. She is not even a queen or a princess. The reason I picked this out Thanks is a very long time ago, I had my very, very first sour, and it was the original Duchess. It wasn't the cherry, Ooh. and I was a real fan of it. Oh. So then I found it, and I said, hot damn, I need to get this. <laughs> and I also knew that one of our hosts on the show would hate it. So thanks. Wait, where did you get this? From? I figured we can get all kinds of. Did we all right, get this same place? Okay. Oh, this was from the office as well. Mm -hmm. Fantastic! Thank Southport you, office, for having seller. such a for having such a nice selection. I didn't mind what I had. I like it. Actually. I'll give you just a little. That tastes bit. like cherry soda. No, do a little more. A little bit more. There you go. Oh my god! It is beer. It obviously. It smells <laughs> like red wine. Now this was a little bit. This was one that was a little more expensive. It does kind of smell like red wine. But this is a genuine, real sour. So mm -hmm. there is. I like sours. They do it the the way they did it in pretty much the 1800s on this one. This you can't replicate how Ooh. this tastes. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. This is a great beer. Right. I would I would say if you find the original Duchesses, pick it up. This is such as cherry. This is six point. But I like the I for my first initial sample, I like the original one better. Okay. So this is but. six point eight percent malt Ooh. beverage aged in oak casks with natural flavor added. Parentheses cherries. cherries. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Cheers. Uh -huh. 
I do not like it. Yeah, actually, because I mean, this this was seven fifty a bottle. Mm. But believe it or not, that's actually a really great price Authentic for this beer. Authentic cherry I don't ale. hate this. I, I like do it. not like sours, but because of, I think the cherry is good enough and the sour isn't so strong. It's a six comma. Case. Either that or Courtney's pork was so bad that I can't taste anything <laughs> correctly now. <laughs> Probably that. I Look, don't hate this. It's a six comma eight, not a six point eight. <laughs> it's it's or eight <laughs> percent. They're not sure. Comma. They need Actually, to Jesus, they need, they need to see that. <laughs> That's bad. That is a real mess up there. Maybe it's sixty-eight percent. Six. Eight. If it's sixty-eight percent, I love it. Where is it? Where is that on there? Comma eight. I'm trying to get it. Oh, on okay. There. Oh, <laughs> zoom. Focus. Uh, you Mr. Can't Bell, see you're it. screwing up your job. Yeah, Mr. Bell. Nugget. I don't hate this, and I do I love not it. like sours. What do I give it? Four point five. I for a sour, I will also give it a four point three. That's not possible if we're doing untapped ratings. Do I look like I work for Untapped? You know. <laughs> no. Do you use Untapped? Do you use? Kind of. Pokemon Go. <laughs> I, 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 I hate to say it, but I 100 percent agree with you guys. Six. Yeah. 4.5. You hate yeah, to say I'll it. Go with four point. Yeah, I'm good with 4.5. Because I don't like agreeing with people. I'm good with 4.5. You're a very argumentative guy. Well, not really. Okay, like, annoying. I mean, had you had this before now? <laughs> never. Okay. I've never had So, this. most sours I do not like at all. That's true. Um, but I like sours. At all. The first bite of it was strong, hence the face. I can't help the face. <laughs> Um, you can't help this face. I'm not allowed to taste beers at Southport Tap and Cellar because of the faces that I make. Uh, <laughs> I can only get things that I know that I like. Um, yeah, shout out to you, Dwayne. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Dwayne. Let's see. Southport Tap and Cellar. Place to be. Right across from Locals. 817 North House Street. Also, next video we'll have quite a few beers from them. Yeah. Mm. Maybe three. <laughs> It may or may maybe not be five. All three. Who knows? <laughs> it may or may not be all three. Tends to be three. Oh well, no, we're not just doing two. Maybe one. Maybe five. Maybe I'll be on the floor. Mm. Oh, no, that sounds weird. <laughs> That's a different video channel completely. I keep thinking of our other channel. <laughs> uh. All right, so overall, no, overall bad. impressions, guys. I mm. love this. Before we end this, before it goes to twenty minutes. I like this. I don't think that I could have more than one. Because yeah, I, I, I the, the sour cherry is a little has a little bit of a bite in the back for me, and it's making it almost tastes. Uh, it has an aftertaste in my throat of like drinking sour mix. Okay. So it'll get. I oh, feel like, like it'll get sore. Mix? Yeah, or uh, like amaretto sours. So I feel like um, it would make it ew, sore after a while. Gross. Um, yeah, I don't think I could drink a lot of these, but I love it. Mm. Like it's really good, but it's you can't have too too much. Of yeah. It. I'd still give it a four or five. Yeah, four or five. For what it is, and I do not like sours. But one is probably enough. Maybe two. I might give it a 4.25 <gasps> just because these bastards here <laughs> are cheating us. And everyone does 12 ounces. They do 11.2 fluid oh, ounces. Acceptable. Look at that. That's the weirdest number ever. Look at that. Acceptable. 11.2. No one can see. But, no, honestly, guys, this, this is a really good beer. If if you find any of the Duchess series, <laughs> pick up the Duchess. Don't block me. <laughs> They're great. Block him. This is for Cam. But uh, <laughs> this is tap me in, going out as we enjoy this beer. I, I'm out. Well, I already <laughs> I enjoyed it already. Thanks, guys. We'll see you next time. Cheers, guys. <laughs>